Hey there, Ulti Zeta here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Black 2. We are in the third bonus episode. In this episode, we've got some stuff to take care of. And first and foremost, I un I even before that one girl was like, "Hey, go find a Zoroark." I already looked up what the deal was with this. So we go back to Victory Road and find that Zoroark that was blocking the path. Remember them? That was N's Zoroark. I think they were... Down here, maybe? Third here. Hi. Quan! Come back here, please. Oh, so they're leading me over to where the door was. Quan! So this is the new stuff. In here. Quan! That's a path. Hmm, okay, I thought that was part of a cave. And... Welcome back to End's Castle. Hello. You came. This. This is Team Plaza's castle. The ruins of Getsis' dreams. The deepest chamber of this castle. It's a place that holds a special meaning to me. I have to face you there. Follow me. Actually, rather than just leading you there, I prefer to follow. That way I can see which path you choose and observe what catches your interest. So I ask this of you. Take me to the deepest chamber of this castle. Okay. Protein. Hold on. Sorry, I need to feed my Pokemon drugs real quick. Don't worry, they like it, Ent. They, they, trust me. This is what they want. What is it again? Attack? Uh, I... I don't think I can give that to anybody except Crunch. Alright. So... I don't know exactly where I'm going. But I have a feeling there would be wild Pokemon in here. I guess I could probably find one. Overheat. Interesting. I don't have any Fire-type moves on any of my Pokemon. But I don't know if Overheat is possible to use by any of them. Now, let's see if I remember the way to go, if this is even remotely the same map. This is our destination. Go inside. Okay, that was easy. Well, I'll be saving beforehand, because it's important to do so. And I think for the Pokemon I want... I'll take you, I think. I think you'll be effective. We'll find out. The end game of the first game. That's the place. It was two years ago, for the sake of Pokemon, for my ideal world. I put my beliefs on the line and battled a certain trainer, and I lost. Why didn't it memory link my name there? But at the same time, I learned something important. To make the world better, you must accept different ideas. I learned that this is the formula for changing the world. Accepting different ideas. I want to see if you're a trainer whose heart is strong enough to do that. Zekrom, come! Shaq! Zekrom also wants to know what ideals you seek and how good a trainer you are. Battle with me, are you prepared? As I'll ever be. Bazazazazazash! Interesting, you got a new theme, man. Alright, this battle is just against Zekrom. But it's level 70. So, let's see if Zekrom is harder than his friend when he's merged into Qrem. Alright, Rocky Helmet definitely helps a little bit. Alright, you are Electric-type. I thought so. Let me hear the voice of your Pokémon!
Okay. That Rocky Helmet definitely coming in clutch now. Um, let's see if Heart Stamp's fast enough to kill this. You have full restores, you... That's annoying. That's actually very annoying. I wouldn't have killed it anyway, though. Well. If that's the case, I'm reviving. Because Crunch is absolutely very useful here. What with the whole... Intimidate and all that jazz. I don't have anything else necessarily. I can send out Dragon Tail. Dragon Tail might be faster. But I kind of don't want to take that chance. Wide Guard will survive a guaranteed hit. Seal the opponent's moves, okay. I'll hit you with two Ice Beams then. Oh my god, this is the first time this has happened to me beneficially! And Reshiram's the fire one, so Reshiram would have been able to get out, but... Wide guard coming in clutch. Okay. Thanks. All right. We beat N. The love for your Pokemon permeates every cell of your body. If you say so, N, you're the one who talks to them. Zekrom and I were defeated. Your feelings, your desire to know the truth, that's what surpassed us. Battling with you reminded me of two years ago. It may just be a little, but I know you better. That's how I feel. And Zekrom, thank you for everything. My journey with you has been truly wonderful. From now on, I want you to use your power to help this trainer realize her dreams. Baz. I know, I'll miss you too. But your task is to help humans who seek ideals. I've learned so much from you. I'll do my best to tell everyone else what I learned on my own. I'll be okay. I can talk to Pokemon. I'll become the bridge between ho Pokemon and humans. And he was never seen again. So, rest well. Ulti, I'll entrust you with this Darkstone. Take that Darkstone to Dragon Spiral Tower. If we do that... That means we can catch Zekrom, which is why I talked about hunting legendaries. It will be the first and only Zekrom I ever get. Probably. I don't know. So, cool beans. There are other fights against N, but I don't know if I'm going to do them, necessarily, because they're high levels, is the thing. They're pretty, they're, they're pretty high level. They're mid-70s, and I also know that they don't... They're just for fun. Oh, this room still exists. Creepy. Now, what happens if I use an escape rope? I've got some of those, right? I don't need to be here anymore. Takes me here. Perfect. Alright. Well. With that victory over N, we can head over to Asiris City, because we need to go to Dragon Spiral Tower. Okay, and here in Asiris... Oh hey, the old ice gem. No one cares. 
Dragon Spiral Tower is right up here. There's an item up there. Fine, I'll go see what the item is. Oh, I can't. I, that's right, I need it to be... wintry. Fine, I won't see what that item is. Still don't know anything about it. Hi, Daddy Juniper. Let me just move on. I want to get my thing. Yes, I know. Old Gato. Okay. Moving on. I remember this place. Not like it was the back of my hand, just in general, but... This is where you can get Golurk. You know, the Pokemon I said that I wished I could have. Elixir? Okay. I don't think there's gonna be any trainers here, necessarily. Also, luckily, I still have strength, so I can just make do with this. Just get myself a handy dandy shortcut. An extra Ultra Ball. I bought like 99 of them. I have so much money in this game, it doesn't fucking matter. So I, I'll be safe no matter what happens. I wasn't missing this puzzle. Shiny stone. Once we reach the top, then we can catch Zekrom. Protein, another one. Okay. Well, we know who we're using that on because we can only use it on one. Because no one else will accept it. I guess I could probably put it on... Wide Guard, but I don't need it necessarily. I don't know. How many floors are here? I don't remember. There was a whole Team Plasma thing in the original game. With the repels, it's all just kind of empty, but I don't mind that. Lustrous Orb? Oh, these are the... Oh, uh, these are the Dialogapalka Giratina orbs. Yeah, that's why there's three. I was just, it was so weird and confusing. I was like, what the hell? Why are these just here? All right, I think this is the final floor based on what I remember. So just in case there's a, a cutscene that ruins things, I'd rather save before entering. Oh, no, there's this room, right. Okay. All sorts of funky 3D. PP Max. Sure. I'm glad I bought a few extra repels. That would be nice. I should find out what that other item is. But I'll get that on the way out. How about that? Because I feel like I'm nearing the end. Comet Shard. Okay, this is definitely the end. I definitely recognize this. And also the tiny little path makes it kind of obvious. The Darkstone, it's trembling inside the bag. Don't destroy my bag. I don't really know why we had to do it this way. But okay. Oh, we got a cutscene, too. 
we get to watch this all over again. Here he comes. Hello. Welcome, Zappy Boy. Honestly, Zekrom is... I kind of think I think Zekrom is cooler than Reshiram nowadays. I think if it were up to me, like nowadays, I probably would have gotten white and white too, rather than black and borrowed black too. Because I think Zekrom's kind of cooler, to an extent. Alright, so I don't have to fight this thing. I mean, I, I like them both. But if I was choosing just based on... The, them. I think I might have gone with Zekrom over Reshiram. Okay. I've saved the game. Hello. Let's see how this goes, because I'm not using my Master Ball on you. You might wonder why. The answer will come later in this video. But that does mean that I gotta fight and try and catch this thing somewhat legitimately, which means I'm gonna be making use of some Mud Slaps because this thing's gonna kill me if I don't. I'm faster than it now. Used in prison. That is really useless for you. Oh right, it's wild now. So it's not it's not gonna be smart. It's just gonna use random moves, because that's what wild Pokemon do. I mean pretty much every game, I think. They just select one of their moves at random. And it seems to only want to do in prison. So the more I mud slap you, the better, in my opinion. I'll just slowly whittle you down. I don't... The only move I have that can really, like, cause a status effect... Is, I do believe, uh... Ice Beam, which is very rare, so I'm not going to chance that, and also it would do a lot of damage. So, don't really want to deal with that. So instead, I'll just keep Mud Slapping. I should be able to do one more. Alright, excellent, and it finally hit me for the first time. I have the rocket helmet. Okay. I'm just gonna do the exact same thing. Let's be right back. Huh. It has an electric type move and a psychic type move. So I, I'm... Half of its th three quarters of his moves are useless against Crunch. Crunch is amazing for this. Huh. That's really funny. Okay, please don't die. Okay, it crit me. So that's actually pretty good in that regard. Because by killing, by killing me and taking the damage, I might have actually killed it. And I don't want that. Now this to help make it easier to just exist. I'm gonna cotton guard. Raise my defense if it does get an attack off. And now Time to use Pokeballs. So I'll meet you guys when I have this thing. Unless I get it right now. Cool. Cool! Significantly faster than I ever expected that to take. Deep Black Pokémon. This legendary Pokémon can scorch the world with lightning. It assists those who want to build an ideal world. Maybe it has an increased catch rate, all things considered. Anyways, its, it's special move is Fusion Bolt, right? I think so.
I'll double check that real quick. Yep, it's Fusion Bolt. Apparently Victini can learn it somehow. Don't know how, but whatever. Thankfully, this is not Reshiram, because Reshiram's Fusion Flare, so that's one letter too much. Hi, Anne. What's up? Zekrom has recognized you as the new hero. That's right. I have a trainer with a will that's strong enough to change the world. I have something to tell you. Go to the giant chasm. Kyurem has returned. That's my friend has told me. Ulti. The world that you desire for Pokemon and humans. I look forward to seeing how full of love that world is. Someday, Pokemon and humans will be bound together without Pokeballs. They will simply trust and help one another. Make that kind of world. And thus, the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon world was born. Alright, let me go get that item I missed on the way out. So the item just goes this way. I don't really know why I missed it, but I did. Dragon Claw. Okay. I don't know if that's better or worse than the one I have. Alright, and with that said, now I can escape rope out of here. Why is this... What, what is this place, then? Can I fly out of here? Would you let me do that? Wow, fuck you, game. <laughs> Why is this not considered a dungeon? Whatever. I guess I'm extra glad now that I saved a thing for me to do on the way out. Um, well, either way, I'm gonna meet you at an unexpected place. Okay. We are at Nimbasa City, of all places. And you have a thing to say to me, apparently. On the final episode, I'll finally wind up accidentally getting 50. And it'll be glorious for that one man only, and only him. Okay. So... Here's the thing, I did not buy all those Pokeballs just for Zekrom. I did- I meant to hit down, and it didn't register. Whatever. Not the end of the world. Route 16. We previously got blocked off going in here. But now we can go here because it's post-game. Welcome to the Marvelous Bridge. Uh, a psychic type. Yes, I'm gonna be fine. Yeah, spoilers. I'm about to fight a psychic type. What? What psychic type? Well, people who know this game probably know. But if you don't know this game, it's gonna be a surprise to you. Do you remember when I went to the ghost house and got a thing? Well, apparently that thing goes here. Somewhere. The lunar wing started shining. Do you want to hold it up high? Yes. Lunan! Hello. Meet Cresselia. This was a Pokemon from Sinnoh. I did not show it in my Platinum playthrough because I didn't really show much of any of the post game in that. But I also think this thing was like a really hard to get thing in those games, so... Whatever. It's pretty much here and offered up to you. So... Lunan! Let's see if we can get a Cresselia, as it just has a regular wild battle theme, and nothing special. It's level 68, so it's a little bit weaker. Alright. Well, that's upsetting. Future Sight won't do anything to me. Okay, that at least does a little damage. It has Slash, which will Rocky Helmet me. So 
so I should probably take... I think the Rocky Helmet will actually be fine, so I'm gonna start just throwing Pokeballs. Do you want to be in a dive ball? Didn't think so, but it was worth an ask. Alright. Let's just start throwing Ultra Balls. As soon as it hits Crunch once, I'm taking Crunch out because of the Rocky Helmet. But it might never do that, so who knows. I don't think the Rocky Helmet with, will kill, but I'm not going to attack it myself anymore. It can heal itself with Moonlight. Ooh. Okay, that's obnoxious. That makes it significantly a little more... Annoying! Hmm. Hmm. Okay, how many P how much PP does Moonlight have? Let's find out together. Power points five. I think it just used it four times. So it either has one more it can do, or none it can do. Okay, there's the last one then. I'm almost positive that's all five. Okay, well... I'm glad we ran those out. Here's a slash. I don't want a chance attacking it, so I'm just going to actually start using timer balls now. Because I've definitely had a lot of turns. Okay, not good enough. Yeah, there's another slash. Okay, so I can do that again. And it'll be fine. Okay, there it goes again. Okay, get Crunch out of here. At this point, it doesn't necessarily matter, but Dragon Tail's my highest Pokemon, so I'll shift in Dragon Tail. And now I chuck balls at it forever. So I'll meet you guys when one of them works. Or it kills itself from struggle. That's an other option, and I hope it doesn't come to that. But it is an option, I should admit, that might happen. Didn't have to wait very long. I barely finished talking about what I was going to be doing. Okay. Timer balls, heck yeah. On nights around the quarter moon, the aurora from its tail extends and undulates beautifully. Well, I think, considering everything, it's only fair to name her Moonlight. Couldn't find the T for some reason. Alright, cool beans. And now if I finish crossing the bridge, I think I'd get an achievement. And a wing, apparently. No. There's like a delay on when you can like hit down there for some reason. What is this, Pikmin 2? This used to be a triple battle. Okay, it's not a triple battle anymore. You know what, I'm gonna double P 
save now that I caught that Cresselia just because it's, you know, really nice and I don't want to lose it. <laughs> okay. So, that is... Well, I guess arguably all the legendaries I wanted to get. I guess I'll fight this person because I can. Okay, and I now have the Pokemon Transfer Lab. Not that I really need it, but it, it exists and it's still here. Hi. I have all the gym badges. Yep, this is pretty much the same cutscene as before, but maybe I'll get an item. I don't know why it's so hard to n utilize a slingshot machine, but whatever. This is the same as before. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Well, it's nice that that's unlocked, but I don't think I need it at any point. Oh, another battle. Oh, my. Hmm. Well, here's the thing. I'm not really using Crunch for Dragon-type moves. I have a Dragon-type for that, so... I don't think Outrage would be good on Crunch, even if it is strong. Okay. So once I get to Black City, because this is pretty much the best way I can get it, on my map screen anyway. This place has definitely changed up a whole bunch. There are actually people here now. I don't know if I ever talked about it before, but the reason why Black City was empty in the original game is because it's based on how long it takes when you like s start the game to when you get there, but like since you, you need to get there like within like two or three days in order for it to be worth anything, so like it's not I don't understand why they did that. It's com completely nonsensical. But yeah. This is where the Benga dude was, the little elder. He shows up here. This is where the, all that goes, but that's not really what I'm here for. At this point, I only have a few other things left that I'm really interested in doing. And I guess one of them is Giant Chasm. I might as well get the other Kyurem. Since this was a legendary catching episode and all. Also, I just realized, thinking about it, considering I've been trying to use different Pokémon on the thumbnails when I can for these episodes, pretty much the only exceptions have been Gym Leader Pokémon, since that's kind of a tradition of me of mine to utilize uh, the gym, a gym leader's Pokemon for a thumbnail. Um, but since I already have Kyurem and Zekrom in... I already have both of them in... as thumbnails in the... In black one, basically, is, is, is the words I'm trying to come up with. For some reason, I'm having a hard time talking. It's almost as if I'm being me, like, normal. Um... But, yeah. Because of that, it's likely that Cresselia was already on the thumbnail, and as a result, you guys 
who didn't know already probably understood that it was going to be a Cresselia episode alongside other things. Mm. Oh, there's an item all the way up here that I didn't get. How do I, hell do I get over there? I can't, the problem with all these trees is I can't tell what their hitboxes are. This item better be freaking worth it. Carbos, okay, you are kind of worth it then. Would have gotten this way earlier. Raises speed. Can't hurt. Wait, muscle wing does something, right? Raises attack? Sure, I'll give that to wide guard. All right. Mm -hmm. God damn it. This item really better frickin' be worth it. It's not gonna be worth it, is it? It's absolutely not going to be worth it. It was not worth it. Okay, well, if you want the sunstone, it's there. If you want, I don't know, it's fucking sunflora. Whatever. God, I hate these trees. I can't tell how I get around them. There we go. Kiram, you're not worth all this. I already have two of you. And one of them's named Cutie Pie. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna attack when I open- enter the room, so I might as well. Uh, who should it be out in front for the... thing? I don't freaking know. Once again, I kind of don't have a good team against Kiram. Whatever. I'll make two. I will make do. And I'll make stew. Hi. What's up, Kiram? Well, it's level 70. I'll get an Intimidate off, and it's going to use wild random moves. Fortunately, it has in pressure, so I'm only going to get to use five of these Mud Slaps. As opposed to all ten. Because pressure makes things happen half as fast, but if it uses Dragon Pulse, it might not even matter. Alright, keep imprisoning. I mean, I mean, imprisoning. -ning. That's a weird word to pluralize. Scary face. After all the accuracy, you still hit me with Dragon Pulse? Dungus. Alright. Here, I'll Dragon Pulse you right back. Oh, we can't... right. Alright, well don't kill, Dragon Tail. I know that's hard for you, but you probably won't. 
I said probably. You know what I've decided? There are no Roman Pokemon in this game, and I'm, I don't even know if I'm going to be going for any other legendaries. So I'm just going to Master Ball this thing. I, I feel like that's the best I can do. Is Because, like, I don't even have a great team for this one this time around. Unlike with Cresselia and Zekrom, which I had crunched to tank everything. I think it's just way easier. But also, first, I'm going to throw a quick ball. Yeah, okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. Alright. Can I have the Master Ball? And what else am I going to use it on? I don't even... There are other legendaries in this game, but they're most... They're pretty much all from other generations at this point, and there's no roaming legendaries anyway, so I don't care. Okay? I just don't. And this one, I feel like, whether or not it learns the move, I don't care, I'm naming it Icy Wind. Because, I mean, what else would you name it? Probably another ice-type thing, whatever. Okay. Hi, guys. That was Kyurem right now. That's the legendary Pokemon Team Plasma. Or should I say, guess this was using. You're amazing! You showed Juniper your Pokedex. She was very happy. There's still many Pokemon that are waiting to meet me. How many Pokemon? About 898-ish, although that's before Scarlet and Violet come out. And actually, by the time you guys are watching this, Scarlet and Violet probably did just release. So that's pretty neat. I mean, for me, it's still May 9th, so I've got a ways to go. Alright. Take me out of here. Yes, this is exactly where I was hoping that was going to take me. Alright. Well, there's not really much else for me to do. That's all the legendaries I really wanted to go for. I think there's like a Latios or Latios somewhere, but I don't necessarily... Let me look to see if I can figure out where that is. Because if it's easy enough, I might try. Yeah, okay, so there's... In the clay tunnels, you can get, like, Reggies, and I don't really care about them. Uh, if you, if you go back to Reversal Mountain, you can get Heatran. The, that's the area that we were talking, going with Bianca in. Uh, there are the three Lake Spirits from Sinnoh. You can get them if you go to the Cave of Being, which is somewhere... Down there. Okay. Probably- I probably can't even get there because I got rid of Surf, all things considered. Uh, and then... Oh! Latios and Latias are just over here. Okay, I actually can try and get them then. Only one is in each game. I don't know which one I'm getting. Let me reread this. Latios I'm getting- I'm getting over here. Alright, well, I guess I can give this one a shot, then. Might as well to round out the legendary catching. Ooh, maybe I can- Ooh, if I do this, I can put Latios on the front, and then make Cresselia more of a surprise! And it'll turn this a little bit more into a foregone conclusion. I approve of that. Shuan! Hi. Shuan! Shuan! Well, I have realized a problem. Much like in the original game, I can't... 
can't proceed without cut. So, one second. There we go. Snatch, you're a lifesaver. For fuck's sake, why was that so hard to find anything, anyone who could use this? I don't understand why every Pokemon I tried could not learn Cut, but whatever. Snatch will save the day. And that's pretty lovely. Alright. Oh. Hi. Yep, that's right, I'm back. Schwan! Now it goes over this way. I assume... Meow! Somewhere in here? It's flying to the right. My repel's not active. Let me fix that real quick. I guess I did think I was done in areas. So, it makes sense that I unrepelled. A rare candy! Okay, excellent. That's pretty useful for me. I can also go over here to get this item. And Schwan! 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 The Ultra Ball. I'll catch it in that Ultra Ball. I should probably save also just to be on the safe side. Because I don't know when this is going to start, and I don't have a Master Ball anymore. <laughs> so I need to catch this one legitimately. I'm assuming I need to go over this way. Oh, no, I need to go up up there, actually. I see. I understand. I didn't before, but now I do. It's like a little game attack. Dream Eater. Dreeter. It's, it's funny. Dream Eater was actually the move that made me think of the, doing my whole naming convention thing to begin with, actually. Also, I just realized something funny. Uh, it was actually one of Small Ant's videos, if you know him. Uh, I was watching it, and he nicknamed a Pokemon Dream Eater, and I was like, Damn, that's a really cool name for a Pokemon. Hi. Thanks for kissing me. I'm glad I saved. <laughs> Alright, so the reason why I'm amusingly throwing out only Snatch is because Latios' moves are Psycho Shift, Dragon Dance, Psychic, and Heal Pulse. I'm a dark type. It can't hit me. <laughs> you know what? Why not? Oh my god, that's probably the best thing it could have been, and yet it did nothing, because I'm, like, a million levels below it. Alright. It actually, it, it genuinely just flat out can't hit me, so... This might not actually be worth doing. 
now that I think about this, because I can't hurt it, per se. Okay, that's interesting. I've... Here's the funny thing about assist, though, is I have so many possible good moves to choose from now. Because all my moves are, like, specially cultivated, like Dragon Pulse, for instance. The only problem is Snatch isn't strong enough to make any good use out of any of it. So, yeah. In the interest of this not taking a million years, let's move this- let's move on to someone who can actually hit for a little bit of damage because Crunch also still can't get hurt by this thing. Oh, but I can't do that. Interesting. Okay, well, I'll play them, I guess? Okay. So, my goofing around was not a good idea, is basically what I'm seeing. Okay, let's try this again. Because I think that was also in part due to all the dragon dances it did. I don't think foul play would have killed it otherwise. I, I realize it's super effective, but like, still, I, I'm i 10 levels weaker than it. Also, just for the heck of it... Hi! Why not? That's why not. Ah, oh, it used one Dragon Dance, that's not good. Thank you for healing me. Yeah, there we go. Alright, well... I'll meet you guys when I've caught this thing. There we go! Third try and third shake was the charm! <laughs> Alright, a highly intelligent Pokémon. By fi folding back its wings in flight, it can overtake jet planes. Alright, and I spent my time while doing that figuring out what I'm going to name him, and I'll name him Reflect, because why not? Most of his other cool moves are too big to fit, so Reflect it is. Alright, and with that, oh, Soul Do, what does the Soul Do do? Is it an item? Yes. Oh useless to me because I can't because I can't keep it when I transfer okay well that's neat got five rare candies that I can use dragon tail already has dragon claw can anyone learn overheat I wonder probably not I guess I'm not figuring that out with Fighty Boy, but it doesn't matter. Fighty Boy? I know what I meant, but whatever. Alright, well, that's the Dream Yard done. So, uh... This is the one who has the guy who, has, who buys the items, so I might as well sell that star thing. Anyways, I think there's probably only going to be one more bonus episode left, because I don't think I'm going to try and fight Benga at the top of Black Tower or whatever. Like, I could. I could try. But I just, I don't think I really want to do that. It's just, it would just be so much. So, I don't know. 
I could do it, I could try. But I just kind of don't want to. I don't need a shiny gibble. Although having a shiny gibble would be pretty cool. It would, it would be a lot of effort. I don't know. Either way, I, I, I think it'll depend actually more so on how the next episode goes, I guess, is a good way to put it. So, next episode are go is going to be some interesting, interesting things. So, that'll be interesting. There's only one or two more bonus episodes left, basically. Man, our box is pretty darn full. Maybe I shouldn't get the gibble, because otherwise it's going to take two boxes, and then it'll be very mildly annoying. <laughs> I did heal, right? I don't remember if I healed. I'll just heal anyway. Okay, so... Next time on Let's Play Pokemon. I don't know how long these episodes have been, but they're bonus episodes, so I don't really care. <laughs>